Hi guys, um, it's Kathleen. Um, sorry about my voice, I'm a little sick. But today we're going to be working on a, um, how to get a perfect nail salon manicure. Um, so let's get started, it's going to be very simple. So I'm trying to, um, again, grow my nails. Um, ever since I got the acrylic, they've really been, um, you know, damaged and not, like, not growing. Um, so I'm using this growth spurt. Um, I've always used it, um, it's, and it's coming really in handy right now. Like, I can really see how it works. Um, I'm using it as a base coat also. Um, so I'm just going to apply that on all of my nails and make sure that I get, you know, all the edges and um, the top of, of the nail um, to, you know, just to grow my nail out. And this also makes it much stronger. So this is what my nails look like after I've applied the base coat. So you have to let that dry completely before you go on to um, putting your nail polish on. The nail polish I'm using is NYC and it's called Tudor, Tudor City Teal. Um, yeah, okay, so I'm kind of going in like slow-mo here. So what I do is I start in the middle and when I go, when I start, I kind of push the brush a little back, um, and then I go forward. And it's, I know if you, if you, you know, really heard about nails and stuff, people kind of do like a three-step, um, thing, you know, where you start in the center and then you do both sides. And that's kind of what I'm doing here, except I'm going over it, you know, a couple times. And also, I leave kind of like a space between my you know where my nail starts and my skin um I feel like if you it looks better you know it looks much cleaner um and and yeah so and then you do the um you do make sure that you get the free edges which you know that'll make your nail polish last ugh, last longer so I'm gonna finish applying the you know, the nail polish on all of my nails, and I'll meet you back. So here's what my nails look like after the first coat. Now this nail polish, um, once I, you know, started doing it, I found that it was, um, very, um, like, it's not very, um, how the heck do you call it? <laughs> like, you need two coats, and I'm forgetting the word. Um, so you apply two coats um, when your nail is completely, completely dry so you won't get any air bubbles. Once my polish is dry, I go, I'm going to go over with Nina and it's called Pink Frost. I, I love, love this nail polish. It's so awesome. It's such a pretty color. Um, and so I'm going to go over it just to give it, you know, a shine and give the nail polish a different look. Um, and, you know, do the same steps as when you were applying the first coat and the second coat. Um, and yeah, that's what they look like. So next for the, um, very important step, cleaning your nails. Many, many, many people do not clean their nails when they are done. And it just, ugh, I don't know, it, it gets me, it gets me. So clean your nails. I use a brush and then I use pure acetone that they sell at Sally's or wherever you go. So really cleaning your nails is the secret to getting good quality looking nails. Next I'm going to use Sech, Sech V. I don't know how to pronounce it. This is the absolute, absolute best top coat you could ever find. Well for me, this top coat, it's... Number one, it dries very quick, which is a plus for me because, you know, I don't really have time to just sit there and wait for my nails to dry. Um, this top coat, it leaves your nails super, super smooth. The first time I tried it, I was like in shock. Um, and yeah, and they just last longer. So this is the final um, look. They, um, you know, 
you get many compliments when you when you follow these steps. I can tell you that. Um, it's very easy, very simple. So try it out and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.